Hey, this is Sidney Friedberg, Deputy Editor of Breaking Defense here at the gigantic, enormous, chaotic uh, Association of the U.S. Army annual trade show. But this is one of the stars of the show that we want to show you. And here is uh, one of uh, Victory's thousand fathers, uh, Jim Miller of BA Systems, to talk about the latest uh, production version of the armored multi-purpose vehicle. Yeah, so this is, uh, as, as you said, Sydney, one of our first production vehicles. We're pretty exciting to bring to the show because we haven't done a production vehicle at a show before. We've always showed a prototype vehicle. So this one is uh, pretty exciting. It's number 13. You can see the number on the bumper there. We have a requirement to do 29 of these. Uh, kind of before the end of this year, beginning of New Year. Uh, we've got 17 of them out with the Army right now and tested Aberdeen and Yuma. This vehicle was delivered to Aberdeen and the Army sent it back for the show. So it's already been delivered to the Army. There's a little bit of dirt and grime on it because it started test, but it, uh, you know, before it came here. So, so it's got, unlike the prototypes you and I have talked about before, this has the reactive armor, it has various defensive systems all integrated that we haven't seen before. Talk me through some of the bells and whistles sticking off. Yeah, so, yeah, let me start with that because uh, there's obvious changes from what we did last time. So we've got the, the uh, kind of the Army issue protection package on this. So it's a combination of bar armor and the, you see here, the inert uh, reactive armor. Uh, but all that's been applied to this vehicle. Uh, you'll see things like uh, this device behind me with the word front on it and the antenna in the back are devices used to jam roadside bombs, mm -hmm. sometimes referred to as crew devices, CREW. Uh, we've got a turret mounted on this one, which is new from the prototype we showed. It is also the way they're gonna be issued. And this is the general purpose vehicle, uh, one of five variants. And so this vehicle is yes. kind of the workhorse of the Armored Brigade Combat Team. And what is this system here? So this is a smoke grenade launcher uh, to give yourself uh, concealment in case you uh, you know bump into the enemy and want to put some smoke up in front of you. Because this vehicle is not a frontline combat vehicle. This is a support vehicle that wants to get out of there if it, yeah, people are shooting at it. You, this is not a fighting vehicle. This is a support vehicle. It's got the protection to get up front with the M1s and the Bradleys, but you don't want to stay in contact with the enemy. Understood. Well, thank you very much, Mr. Miller. Good to talk to you.